All right. Can't swing my sword in the village. Lame. I want to kill the villagers. We provide meals and lodging. I bet you do. Long time no see. You look like you've been good. <laughs> no, maybe that's too disinterested. Hey, Nayuta. Long time no see. No, that's not me at all. Ugh. Get it together, Lyra! This is no time to be nervous. We haven't seen each other in months. Is that you, Lyra? No, 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 Yuta! When did you... Just now. You're looking kind of adorable, Lyra. I ship it. <laughs> How have you been? And, uh, what brings you here? You, you uh, dope. Well, well, I heard you guys were back, and... Oh, Lyra, you biffed it. Y yeah, a long time no see. Nayuta, man. Oh, come on, stupid me. Why am I speaking like a robot? Lyra, are you feeling okay? You know, I've actually been collecting some rare stones from a cave near the academy. If you take a look, I'm sure you'll feel more energetic. Uh, I think I'm good. Thanks, though. Ah, uh, he hasn't changed at all. Hey, Nayuta, looks like you're back. You in there macking on my sister, Signa bro? Signa mail? Yeah, you too? Yep, just a little while ago. A little while? Signa, don't tell me you just saw that. Nope, I didn't see a thing. I certainly didn't see you pacing in front of the house, preparing to see your childhood friend. And I definitely didn't catch you carefully choosing your first greeting before messing up. Nor did I think anything like, oh, to be young. So you were watching! I wonder what they're talking about. Well, that's that. How'd the commission go? Yeah, I managed to finish it. Master Orbis seemed upset that you didn't show up, though. Oh, I see. Well, that's, uh, that's okay. Some new requests came in, so we should get started on them right away. I mean, I'd be happy to accept Lyra's dating council request. Hey, don't mind me! <laughs> the more they fight, the closer they are. What was that just now? It sounded like it came from the sky. Wait for me! Hey, Nayuta! It might be that phenomenon. Anyway, the direction is... Like, both are reversed. Down is up, and left is right. Oh shit, that's a big boy. Did that just kill my sister? That looked like he came awfully close to my damn house. Guess not. Are you guys alright? Yeah, somehow. What was that just now? It wasn't a shooting star or anything. No way. More ruins are falling. Yeah, that's what it looks like. It's been happening a couple of times a year. I've been on Remnant Isle for five years and I still haven't gotten used to it. But this one's obviously way too big. Normally it's just some debris falling with the shooting stars. Yeah, I've never seen such enormous ruins fall either. I'm worried about everyone in the village. It was quite an impact. I think it fell in the Cape area. Let's go see what's going on, Nayuta. Right. Wait, take me with you! No, Lyra, it's too dangerous. Hey, man, are you sure this is a good idea? I can't believe such enormous ruins fell. Let me at least see what's going on. Now, guys, just calm down for a second. Dorado, where did the ruins... Oh, it's you guys. Everything looks okay for now. Wait, why are you here, Dorado? Isn't it the Watchman's job to take the lead in a situation like this? Yeah, I mean, I'm just trying to keep everyone out since that's what Mr. Orbis told me to do. Master Orbis did? Yeah, he said he's going to check on it by himself. 
Even if a monster does come out of the ruins, I'm sure Mr. Orbis will handle it in no time. <laughs> He's really dependable, isn't he? What do you mean? Ha ha ha. You lousy watchman. What? what? Isn't that going too far, Lyra? Anyway, can you let us go check it out? We might be able to help. We're the handyman, after all. Ah, yeah, sure. I think I can let you guys through. Just be extra careful out there, you hear me? Of course. Do you mind waiting for us here, Lyra? All right. You guys better not come back injured or anything. <laughs> There's absolutely no reason to worry. Let's go, Nayuta. Oh, that's some good-looking ruins. Oh, damn. Oh, there's a high-speed mode. Master! Hmm? You guys, I thought I told Dorado to stop you. It's too dangerous here. Don't be a drag. We came anyway just in case there's something we can do to help. Hmm. Wow, looks like it fell closer than I thought. <clears throat> they look like some kind of tower ruins. It's a good thing we didn't have a big wave after this landed. Yeah, though it seems a bit rough offshore. The ruin's about 312 arch tall. It's huge! Indeed, it's on a completely different scale than the ones that usually fall. It may be a building, but there are still monsters inside. We'll need to keep an eye on how things progress. Alright, let's go, Nayuta. You got it. Wait, you two. Did you not listen to what I was saying? We just have to keep an eye out on how things go, right? We'll take a quick look inside. Don't worry, we've fought monsters before. You, I hope you're not doing this out of mere curiosity. It could become deadly. Er, well... Ah, my pupils are such troublemakers. It is true that investigating the ruins is necessary to ensure the safety of the village. And I do not sense powerful monsters inside either. Don't let your guards down and I'm sure you'll be fine. Then, remember... Being driven by curiosity can be fatal. You must take this seriously as an investigation for the sake of the village. Understand. Oh, yeah. Yes. Then I'll explain the situation to everyone. If you ever feel like you're in danger, I want you two to turn back immediately. And when you're done, Cigna, come to the beach. I'm going to give you some training. The train you skipped on earlier. Dang, you remembered? What a cunning old man. He even noticed that we're, we weren't actually prepared for any danger. I guess we're no match for him. <laughs> You're right. Now let's find a way to cross over to those ruins. I think we can reach those ruins if we walk on the reef. You ready, Nayuta? All ready. I'm ready to go anytime. As Master Orbis said, this is for the safety of our village. Let's stay on our toes. Yeah! So I can make the action RPG in high speed mode, too. Interesting. So I wonder if this is like one of the I wonder if this is like one of the older East games. Wow, it looks even bigger on the in, from the inside. This is gonna be a tough one. Wow, this is incredible, Signa. I never thought we'd get to explore such a huge ruin. There might be some clues here that'll help us figure out the mystery of the star fragments and the falling ruins. Now Yuta, didn't we just talk about keeping our focus? Er, my bad. <laughs> well, thanks for that. I'm more relaxed now. Looks like some parts are crumbling because of the impact of the fall. Anyways, remember, we've got to stay focused, buddy. Right. Signa's now accompanying you. Six crystal stones you find in stages can be used as money. It looks like there are monsters after all. We've got to get rid of them before we get to the island. Before they get to the island. Alright, let's make this quick and easy. Chain accumulates in the lower left hand corner of the screen. If you tech units without taking damage, your chain exceeds a certain number, your game bonuses, blah blah blah. Alright. Alright. Looks like they're almost blocking the road. We might be able to jump over it. Looks. Yo, what's up, Reefer? How are you doing? If it's just that much, then maybe we can destroy it. Who knows? Something interesting might even pop out. <laughs> I guess I'll give it a try, then. Stages have various objects that may drop items and destroy it. Destroy it. You got an item. Yada, 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 yada. Longhorn Stag Beetle. 
Alright, so can I switch characters? No. Grab some money. Mini platforming section. Oh man, it's completely destroyed. Uh, what a waste. We might have been able to figure out something if it kept its shape. Well, let's keep on looking. Seems like we have to jump up this way. Midair jump by pressing A while jumping. Second jump, you can reach distant places. Oh, I have double jump. Sweet. What is that? I'm curious about that thing from earlier. Oh, okay. Okay, we have to do that. A serious energy prevents you from passing through. Oh, the light's gone, so that was a trick to break that barrier. <laughs> I think I'm going to enjoy this more than I thought I would. I know, it's not every day we get to do something this exciting. Don't leave me behind, okay? Yeah, yeah, I know. Anyway, there's still more to go. Let's get a move on. Fifty Mira. Monsters sometimes drop ingredients when defeated. Like multiple ingredients make even better lunchboxes. The rarer the ingredients, the higher the rank of the lunchbox. So there's like little mini platforming stuff too. This is actually gonna be kinda sweet. Looks like we're pretty high, but man, this ruin is seriously huge. Looks like there are gears moving all over the place. I'll have to check every nook and cranny. Hey, careful! Ah. Are you okay? I'm gonna pull you up right now. Yo, thanks, Signa. You saved my life. Good thing you're still okay. Seriously, couldn't you tell a scaffolding is unstable just by looking at it? Haha, <laughs> sorry. I let my guard down a little too soon. I can really count on your instincts, Signa. Keep your senses sharp at all times. I guess Master Orbis' teachings are a part of me now. Anyway, let's keep going. Don't let your don't let up until the end, okay? Gotcha. I think I can jump far enough. Alright, let's keep running. Before we get the end of the first first. Oops, looks like it went outside. Hey, look, Signa! <laughs> wow, we can see the whole horizon. Yeah, what a view. I didn't know we were so high up. There's no sign of any monster here. What do you want to do? Head back to the village? But well, we can go even higher. We might as well since we're here. There might still be places left to look, or maybe even some historical records. <laughs> I knew you'd say that. Alright, let's head up, but watch your step. Alright, let's go. So there's a boss up here? There's a child. What the hell is that? It's a child. A cute child. Made of gears. A, a little girl? Hold on. It doesn't look like a kid. It looks like a fairy. Like out of a fairy tale. A fairy? <laughs> Get real! There's no way those actually exist. I know, but... She's right in front of us. Where'd she even come from? I don't know, bro. <clears throat> I have to protect you. Did it just talk? I couldn't really make out the words. And what is that glowing thing? If you look closely, it appears to be some sort of machine. She's holding on pretty tight. Must be important. Anyway, we can't just leave her here. Let's take her back to the village and nurse her. You do 
well to stay out of this. Oh no. What? What the? Oh, this is bad. <laughs> Ganondorf? Is that you? A person just appeared out of nowhere. I did not expect children to be here. Oh, this music is awesome. Even unconscious, you refuse to let go. I admire your persistence, if nothing else. But that gear is essential to me. Ugh! Oh no! We are now all set. The time has come at last to fulfill our long-awaited goal. We must make arrangements to get the key as soon as possible. Stop right there. Signa, I don't think you can beat him. What do you want, human child? I have no time for you. What are you talking about? Snatching a woman's belongings while she's unconscious? Don't think you can just get away with something like that in front of me. Oh, so you play it chivalry. You're spirited, I'll grant you. But you must but you must know who you are dealing with, or you'll end up only suffering. Fight him. Yes, sir. Let's see what you've got. I'll show you just how helpless you are. <laughs> Someone's fighting itself. We'll see who goes home crying after this. What? What is this feeling? Ah! Signa! I'm okay, just keep that girl safe. What is the matter? It's unlikely to struggle with such an opponent. It's nothing. <laughs> Perhaps it was no coincidence that we ended up on this side. So the stars guide us, even now. What are you talking about? <laughs> now is not the time for that. We have things to do on the other side. Let's go. Oh no! We lost him. Oh, get it. Yeah, we have no clue what's going on. Hey, Signa, who were they? They seem to have some sort of magical power, and what was it they were saying at the end? Beats me. Something about this side and that side and some kind of gears? I didn't get any of it. Yeah. Did they call her Noi? We should take her in for We should take care of her for now. Yeah, let's get her to your place. Nayuta and Signa carefully wrapped Noi in a soft cloth. Then they, they then headed to Nayuta's house, making sure they weren't spotted by the other islanders. Doesn't appear life-threatening for now. We brought her here without telling anyone, but... We should be careful, at least until we can learn more about this girl. Plus, I don't know if they'll believe us when we tell them what happened in the ruins. Yeah, I'm glad Earth is not home either. I'm sure she'd be worried and ask a lot of questions. But there's a limit to how long we can keep this girl hidden here. Man, I don't know what the hell we're going to do now. Uh, where am I? Oh, you're finally up. Uh, yeah! Uh, you, 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 you humans! Don't come near me! Oh, Noi is so cute. Well, I think she's afraid of us and humans altogether. 
Hey, Noi, was it? You don't have to be so alarmed. We're not going to try and eat you or anything. Uh, how do you know my name? I'm Nayuta, and this is Signa. We brought you here after we found you in the ruins. If you don't mind, can I ask you how you ended up there? Are you a fairy or something else entirely? Lying? In the ruins? Right, I was running away from those people to protect it. Did the power I stole go out of control and send me to this side? Uh, I don't really get it, but... Basically, you're saying it was a coincidence that you were at the tower ruins. So this girl has nothing to do with the falling ruins phenomenon. Too bad, I was hoping to learn something. Ah! Ah! My master gear! It's gone! No, wait! Did you guys... It flew! Give it back! It's very important! Without it, I... Wait, we didn't take anything. And just what is a master gear? Hey, Nayuta. Do you think she's talking about that machine that the man in the black clothes took away? Isn't that what he called it? The man in black clothes? To be honest, we don't really get what's going on either. They explained how the man in black clothes and his young masked ally appeared, took Noi's item, and left. No way! Oh no! I can't believe Zext... Zext... Chased me all the way to this side. Zext. Is that the name of the man in black clothes? It seems you were being chased, but how do you know him? Well, that's, um, a little hard to explain. But Zext appeared in our world suddenly one day. He and his masked friend are trying to destroy it. Hold on, our world? Destroy? Explain it so that we can understand. Sorry, but with the Master Gear stolen, it's a very urgent situation. I appreciate you saving me, but please forget everything that happened today. Anyway, I have to get back right away. Ah, wait, I still have questions. Noi, get back here! Don't, don't you fly away from me! I think this is a sign that there's a teleportation gate nearby. Um, um... Oh, there it is. Why is it here? It's pretty degraded. We'll just have to give it a try. On my authority as administrator, I ordered this gate to connect to the garden! Oh shit, damn. Let's go! Did you see that, Signa? Yeah, she just disappeared. So you're saying that random place is connected to the world where she comes from. There's so much going on that I'm starting to get confused. Signa, why don't we go after that Noi girl? You, are you serious? We have no idea what's going, what's even through there. What are you gonna do if it takes us to some sort of hell? It could, I guess. But that girl said she came from another world. It might just be the very world I've been searching for. If that's the case, then no matter what kind of place it is, I want to see it with my own eyes. And I can't just leave the girl on her own either. Good grief, man. Well, if my partner insists, I can't just back down. Then, as a handyman, I won't stand by and let those unknown people have shown up. Now, step. I won't stand by now that those unknown people have shown up. Let's follow that ferry before the gate closes. You're right, it might not remain connected forever. I'll go get ready then. I'll meet you at the gate. <laughs> being a big brother is no easy job. That being said, what is this feeling? The feeling I had when I battled with that masked bastard. It's bugging me. If I ever see him again, I'm going to have to get my act together. I'm going to have to get some training going on. Alright, we're gonna have to... We're gonna go into that super portal. 